So one of the first people who realised that there was a relationship between the volume and the temperature was Charles. So the volume is proportional to the temperature is known as Charles's law. So what actually happened with the balloon when we poured the liquid nitrogen over it was that the air inside the balloon cooled down. As it cooled down, the molecules moved more slowly and this meant that they, when they hit the wall, they were not applying as much force. So this caused the balloon to contract as the force pushing in from the outside was then greater than the force pushing out from the inside and so it contracted until a new equilibrium was reached. And then as it heated up, the molecules started to move faster again. Now there's a really funny story with Charles. He actually was playing around with gases and discovered some of these gas laws because he was interested in flying hydrogen balloons. And he was actually one of the first people to ever launch a hydrogen balloon from um, where the Eiffel Tower now stands. But one day he was trying to launch a balloon and at that point, time he didn't know about the temperature relationship so later they realized that they should cool down the gas with water as they put it in to make it easier but back then it was taking them days to fill these balloons and then one night one of these balloons escaped and it flew for kilometers over the countryside and it terrified all the locals and the locals came out and attached the attacked the balloon with pitchforks because they'd never seen anything like it before and they were totally terrified Okay, so the important point is that volume is proportional to temperature.